Miss Lawrence. I teach middle school language arts at Keystone. And tonight, me and my buddy Kip would like to read you a story. A collective noun is a word that means a collection of things, like a cache of jewels for the crowns of kings, or a batch of bread, all warm and brown, is always called a collective noun. A school of fish, a gam of whales, a fleet of ships with purple sails, a bunch of bananas, a cluster of grapes, a muster of peacocks, a flock of sheep, a bouquet of flowers, a swarm of bees, a kindle of kittens, and a pod of peas. A parcel of penguins, a forest of trees, a coven of witches as scary as these, a bed of oysters, a string of beads, a brood of chicks, a clutch of eggs, a litter of puppies on wobbly legs, a pride of lions, a lock of hair, an army of ants from here to there. About 500 years ago, knights and ladies in the know used only very special words to describe their flocks or herds. These words are used by us today, but some were lost along the way and new ones have been added too. I've included quite a few. And there are more of these group terms like sleuth of bears or clue of worms, or rafter of turkeys, walk of snails, leap of leopards, covey of quails. But nouns aren't all collective, and if I'm to be effective, I'll tell you about the other nouns and adjectives and verbs all of them are parts of speech. What fun, I'll write a book for each.